Just what does the word paranormal mean, anyway? The paranormal includes telepathy or communicating by sending and receiving thoughts, extrasensory perception or perceiving that which cannot physically be seen or heard, and psychokinesis, using one's psychic energy to reshape or move objects. Okay, so what I'm learning from this game is, in the 1930s, you had to pay to use your phone, and people had psychic powers. Gotcha. Did you hear about the explosion and fire at the Lilac Inn this morning? I heard the explosion and fire. Ruined my nine o'clock session. So you were with a customer when it happened? Pupil. I was with a pupil. I run a school, not a vegetable stand. And yes, I was. Until I dismissed her 20 minutes early. All the ruckus made concentration impossible. How well do you get along with Emily and her guardian, Jane? Very well, as far as I'm concerned. But as far as they're concerned, well... The fact that Josiah left everything to me made some people around here, including Emily and now this Jane Willoughby, very bitter. It hurts me, of course, but it's human nature, I suppose. Oh well, I have all my money to keep me happy. Were you surprised when you found out that Josiah hmm. had left you everything? Delighted, yes. Surprised, not really. Josiah was all alone, you see, surrounded by people like the Crandalls and that banker, Jim Archer. People who were nice to him only because they knew he had money. Would it be okay if I looked around? Go right ahead. The place is more like a museum than a house. Josiah was a man of many, many interests. I'll be right here if you have any questions. Okay. So, let's explore. What's this? What do you do with these? I put them on the windshields of cars parked in the area. Great advertising. Ever put them on cars at the Lilac Inn? All the time. I've gotten quite a few pupils that way. I'm afraid that fire today was as unfortunate for me as it was for Miss Crandall. Hmm. And what's this? Oh, I know what these are. See, it's animation. Huh? 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 Hmm. Kind of cool, anyway. There's that cat again. And there's a carousel horse for some reason. More flyers. Anything else to explore? Okay. Musical instruments. Fun. La 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 la. Okay. Okay. And what's this? There's the poster from Nancy Drew and the Haunted Carousel. The man on stage in this picture, is that Josiah? Yes, that's from a production of A Midsummer Night's Dream that he directed and starred in. It closed after two nights, but he didn't care. He loved that play. Hmm. What's this, what's this book? Putting Physics to Work in the Modern World. By Sir Walter Crooks. A radiometer. Huh. I don't think I understand. That's what you think. Depends on what you do with the light first, pea brain. Interesting. Josiah Crowley apparently had a book so he could write trash talk in it. As you'll soon realize, Josiah's mental faculties were starting to go, I'm afraid. He tended to ramble. Very little of what he wrote in there makes sense. No, I bet it's just a bunch what of clues to his puzzles. What are you when bounce? What poet is the cat's meow? What will para my miniature golf course get you? What's Gloria's middle name? Well, when you win Bard Bounce, you're keen. He liked Omar Kayashishin, or whatever the poet's name was. I haven't seen a miniature golf course, and I don't know Gloria's middle name. The coder is in the r rivet. Two to the right. Fall down. Oh, well this teaches us how to solve those puzzles that Richard Topham gave us. Do do do. To open journal. The coder is in the rivet. Okay, I figured this out. 
Okay, two to the right. Now, two letters after B is D and two letters after R is T, which means this means decoder is in the trivet. I know that because we learned about a trivet earlier. I still don't know what a trivet is. Okay, CC, whereabouts, room off, tunnel by scrambled picture. Don't know what that means. To open the big clock on the top. Give flute, Fisbee, and Pyramus their clues. Clues are all characters from the Shakespeare play. Bottom's Q is in the note to Gloria. Okay. Poem on the golf course. Sounds like numbers to me. And this is the carousel. Like I said, apparently it's the carousel from Nancy Drew, the haunted carousel. And what's this? Here, here is the trivet I party at Twin Elms back someday. Okay, so let's go to Twin Elms and find out what a trivet is. But let's explore a little bit more. Anything else we can explore? Ooh, robots. Freaky! Very freaky. That room is off limits, I'm afraid. Oh, I'm very sorry. There's that cat again. Hey, Yuri. Was this Josiah's clock? Everything in here was Josiah's. Oh, is this a matching game? These are easy. Ha! Do -do -do. Um, didn't we have gears somewhere here before? I thought I saw gears. Oh, well, anyway, I got that. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hee hee, this is going swimmingly. Nope. And we get... We get... Do we get something? We get an, another mirror. Interesting. Very interesting. And can we explore in this area? No. What? Would you happen to know what Gloria Crandall's middle name was? I haven't the foggiest. Oh well. It was nice talking to you. The feeling is almost mutual. Ooh, jerk. Well, I think I'm running out of time, so I'm going to save my game here. Okay, everyone. Said I'm going to save my game. <laughs> okay, everyone, see you next time. Doo -doo -doo.